Did you nearly fall asleep there? <laughs> I was, um... Just resting my eyes, I think. How did you, uh... How did you sleep? <clears throat> I was um catching up on a few things and then I just kind of you know took a second <clears throat> thank you for yeah sure no biggie right your face what happened oh it's um the leftover from when the guards showed up oh. remember when he hit me with that hammer yeah he did hit you <coughs> nice. should be gone by tomorrow it's just a little bit of bruising it's okay are you throwing these not last night. No. Yeah. We had saw them last night. <laughs> we had this um, <laughs> set up a while ago. I use it to. It's meditative. I'm sure you know. It's the repetitiveness of it. <clears throat> it's good. Yeah. Alan helped me set it up when we moved in. So, um, you were gone all day yesterday, and when you got back, you seemed really spacey. Was the town that bad? Um, I was actually at the embassy doing a mercenary job. Never ended up going to Karana. Oh. <clears throat> so you were in the embassy? Oh. I didn't lie, it's just I found out that they... Uh, uh, they just never got back to me about going, so... Sure. It was no, time to okay. go find a coin. That's fine. Mm. So, uh, what happened? Um, we were escorting, no, we were, um, running security for the front gate. There was, like, an event going on. I don't know. Lots of Imperials, mm. apparently. They, uh... <sighs> I don't mean to complain, but... I tried to warn them. When these people arrived, three of them didn't have their papers. They had all, all of the red flags checked. And yet, the fucking idiot in charge still let them through. He just waved them in, and it was weird. And those same people were the ones that ended up being the problem. They nearly killed Miss Lottie the Baker. They had rigged some kind of trap or um, explosive of some type. With that powder I... that they have, yeah. But that's not what hurt her. There was a man who said he was a noble of something. He had such a weird accent. Mm. <clears throat> Is Lottie okay? You said she got hurt. 
Yeah, that same man that I was talking about, he threw something to stop the people that had rigged these explosives. And it, um... It went a bit wrong. I mean, it did stop them from... Sorry. Still very angry about all of it. It wasn't just Ladia there. Quinn was there. She almost died. Huh. Van Pelt was there, too. The hunter, right. And <clears throat> Cade said his full name in front of him, to him. He did not even try to hide his worry for her safety. And I'm not sure what to do about it. I want to walk up to him and punch him in the throat. He seems to always have to learn the hard way. I hate it. <clears throat> well, yeah, I'm not really sure how to process this. How do you think I feel? <laughs> That's why I can barely get my sentence sentences out. I just found out she's here yesterday or the day before that. And... I can only deal with so much. You know? <laughs> I'm... Small bites, Sarah. I wish Nautis wasn't so small. Hmm. I wish I didn't have to see them every day. And now she's parading around all the time and it's just bringing up old memories that she's I don't want to deal with. Still a slave, no? She's... What she did last time. Yeah. What I heard. It doesn't make sense. Why was she specifically at that party, at that embassy, at that day? I don't know. I... I... <clears throat> Arn would want to kill her if he knew she was there. I know. And I don't know if that should happen or not. Well, <clears throat> at the very least you got out okay. Did you have to use that potion? Uh, no. Yeah. Just as well. Do you want to take it back? I don't need it. If you don't you need, need it. it more than I will. <clears throat> I appreciate it. I'm just glad you didn't have to use it. So, do we know anything about these people that attacked the embassy? Who they are? What their main goal was? No. Nothing. But you're saying the main person in charge let them in. It seemed like that. I knew something was off when they arrived, but it just kind of felt like they were being careless about it. Do you think it was incompetence like or just... nefarious? Definitely incompetence. He screamed mm. at me like I was a drow, derogatory. Huh. <laughs> <clears throat> so. Okay, I guess we'll have to see how this unfolds. I hope this doesn't mean that Imperial Presence will they crack down on the them. city. Uh, I already expect that because of Cade and others, but... Right. At least the ships are gone, right? For now. Mm. 
I'm not even worried about them. I'm more worried about the elves. But... We don't know much about that yet. <clears throat> Imperial elves, they both want to see us burn anyway. It's a lose-lose for us. Almost makes me miss home, but not quite. <laughs> I'm fucking hungry, so <clears throat> yeah. Sorry, I didn't mean to. Drink and nothing to eat yesterday. No, it's fine. I was gonna tell you anyway. Just I don't know. Yeah, there's a lot of that going around. I think. <clears throat> I have to watch you get beat in front of me and I can't do anything about it and then the next day I have to endure that idiot it's like this place is testing me I'd say you're passing so far <laughs> what's the term with flying colors or some shit like that yeah I need to take a drink of water, and then I'll step out. <clears throat> sure. Hey. Giving you trouble. It's the broom. Uh. It's always been the broom. <clears throat> A bad work person always blames their tools. I okay, well listen, you're a tool. <laughs> but the force is clean. Okay, don't blame me for that though. What was that, sorry? Don't blame me for that. For the broom or for the forge? I'm gonna blame you for one of them, you gotta take it back. Which involves the less amount of scrutiny. Uh, considering you share the forge with the old man, probably that one. That one, then. I could yell all day about that broom. Yeah, okay. Well, it's clean, so ain't nothing to bug <clears throat> you about. Thank you. Old man told me to come by every morning, so... There you go. How much do I owe you? <laughs> How much do you owe me? Don't think I didn't see what was in the bucket the other day. Water? Very funny. I don't do free, okay? Free comes with favors. How's your that ain't how I get my way, so. Uh. But we got him a potion, so I'm hoping it works out. But he's still coughing, so we'll see what happens. But it, uh, it meant a lot, because I wasn't sure how long it was going to take me to get it. So if it's going to do something, it's going to do something. Well, I'm glad. You got like a crunchy, soft little sanity, don't you? <clears throat> I'm just tired of people losing family, that's all. Yeah. Well, that's not gonna happen, though, right? No. He's my dad, obviously, so he's tough as nails. If he's anything like you, he'll pull through. Oh, yeah. With my mom talking his ear off? Although maybe that'll make him want to die faster, I don't know. <laughs> I uh, finished that. Everything should be the way it needs to be. You had some weird god come over and inspect or look at your forge. I don't know why, so. Really? Yeah, I didn't really ask too many questions. Just stepped out of the way. Don't know what it was about. Hmm, okay. Thank you. Yeah, he didn't do anything to it, though. So, if that, I would've... <laughs> well, I would've emotionally wanted to beat him upside the head with a broom, but I wouldn't have, because, you know, 
<clears throat> Don't want to lose my hands. What else do I pay you for? If not to defend uh, the forge well, I mean, from tyranny. <laughs> Listen, if you want me to beat a man, it's gonna cost extra. Wait, no, fuck. I see. That's a weird sentence. <clears throat> Never mind, I didn't say that. No, no, <laughs> it's out there now. Alright, good luck today. Nope. Nope, <clears throat> let's. Yeah, you too. The bruise is coming along nice. Hey, thanks. I thought it makes me look more defined. Defined? I mean, you got some type of roguish charm to you, I'll give you that, but... You still just kind of look like a kid who put his hand too close to the stove and got smacked, so... <clears throat> Actually, not very oh, far no, off. So... <laughs> okay, fuck off with this. I can't win, can I? <laughs> what part of your body isn't hurt that I can make fun of? Uh... <laughs> My first instinct was hard, but that's not true. That. Um, let's see, I've been shot in a leg, I've been stabbed in the other leg. My uh -huh. my right ear. Actually, wait, frostbite, no. My left ear, there you go. Make fun of my left ear. Ow. There we go. <clears throat> now it's been injured. Now yeah. nobody can make fun Thanks. of any I'm of you. I'm just a full-on broken Don't say boy. I never did nothing for you. Thanks, Daniela. Oh my gosh, you are. Uh, You've broken me completely. Somebody needs to wrap you up in a cloth. That's very, no, don't very say good of that. You. Oh my gosh. Congratulations. Out of everyone, it could have been. You must feel really proud of yourself. Yeah, no. I'm gonna, the, that broom I'm is giving you trouble, anything. isn't it? That's what I'm, I'm so saying. sorry. It's because I've, we've been putting like <laughs> sticky tar over it. Makes it hard to let go. Maybe. Yeah. One of these days I'm gonna bundle you up in a bunch of top and put you in your house where nobody can hurt you anymore. That like honestly doesn't sound too bad. Yeah, yeah, I'll make sure I bring snacks. On, hey, thanks. I gotta go though. Good I luck. Business to run. Sure. See you later, Kyla. See you later. Good morning. <clears throat> that was your sleep. Where is everyone? The usual. <clears throat> Start putting wood in the forge. We're gonna light it soon. The forge. Hold on. All right. <clears throat> Are you able to make wood tools? Do I put in the top or the bottom? Bottom. For now. <clears throat> Think you can make me a mallet, right? Should be fine. Yeah. Maybe a chisel. Chisel, wooden mallet, okay. Um, any particular style? Or? Is this yeah, not work? And it does Was work sometimes. Uh, yeah. When you're well, not busy, I need a moment chisel. from you. Probably need to, yeah. I have a moment. At the very least, mallet Do you? would be helpful. I'd like to place an order with the forge. This fucking oh, hobbit. Yeah, what do you need? Tang needs a chisel. <clears throat> a chisel? Mm-hmm. Chithel. A chithel. Yeah. Let me have a look. Chithel. Yeah, you know the thumpy thumpy crack cut. Oh, a thumpy thumpy crack cut. Right, 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 right. Well, no, not the thumpy thumpy crack Do you need made of iron or copper? The thumpy swish, thumpy swish type. <clears throat> chithel. Is of iron or copper? Does it matter which material? Hmm. Not really, as long as it's able to cut things. I've heard of well, copper car things. things. If it's cheaper. Yeah, that could be three silver eighty. We could probably drop the price. We need a uh a weapon grip from you as well. Interesting. Yes. Oh well, he actually had to wipe his eyes for that. He said three silver eighty. That wasn't me, that what the hell? <clears throat> oh, <laughs> You made them think that I was wiping my eyes! I, I, I heard the squeegee sound, I thought... I thought that was yeah. Weird. That wasn't me? Yeah, that... Three, okay. three silver 80 I'm according to my sheet. Him, I can't tell. What is a squeegee? Oh, okay. Well, there you go. It's three silver 80. I'm gonna go, uh... I'm missing the run. <clears throat> Son of a bitch. <laughs> So it's three silver eighty for the head of a chisel? For a full chisel. Oh, for a whole chisel. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> Do you want mm, just the head? Mm, no. 
Listen, I'm trying. Mm. Freak, how much should I add? Just a couple bits. We're about to light it soon. <clears throat> and then we'll add more to it as the day goes on. Should be enough then. Yeah, make it hotter or colder depending on Can you light a fire? You're melting. Do you have to light a fire? Can't do that now, Al. I don't really have any tools to do it. Actually, wait, I do. There's flint over there to light the forge Got, with. Uh, <clears throat> Hopper gave me a flint and steel to. He gave you fire. Pipe weed? Yeah. Yes. <sighs> Anyways. <clears throat> I don't have three silver, fifty goppers, so don't worry about the chisel until I get the money. I'm just trying to. <clears throat> How much do you have? You know that guy that came by a while ago? Did you see the woman with glasses on? Uh, I think so. He had a weird accent. Yeah. He gave me a little bit of an idea about what tools that I would need if I actually want to do anything involving what I want to do. And most of them are Smith's tools. Hmm, interesting. Or at least all of them are Smith's <clears throat> tools. I could, uh... So? I could drop the price to three silver for you if you want. Just between you and me, though. Shriek, do I need to add something else Again. that's not catching? I'm broke. Okay. <laughs> well, the option's there. <clears throat> there you go, Tang. It's not catching. <clears throat> hey. Well, there you go. Thanks, Tang. That'll be three, so I'm kidding. <laughs> you motherfucker. You actually have to pay me, matter of fact. This fucking guy. <sighs> One of these you days. Seen the <clears throat> long... One of these days, you're not going to do shit. Have you seen the long beard dwarf? Not today, I've only just started work. Don't get your hopes up, Tang. <laughs> Don't you get your tangs up, Hope. Not to- I just fucking stepped outside of my house, I've moved from there to here, Not and yet. I haven't <laughs> seen him. No, I haven't seen him yet. Ah, oh, bloody. Well, only if you see him. Tell him I talked to the seamstress. Great. <clears throat> I need you to get some iron ore from the pile over there and an iron ingot. <clears throat> the pile. So anyway, yeah. Okay, well, when you have the money. Yeah, I, I, I'm just... Yeah, when, I'm, I'm, just look, I'm trying to figure out what tools that I would actually need. I don't know what things you use to measure stuff, if you even measure things, or you Like a stick that eyes. you just kind of mark. <clears throat> we have templates that we use, or, or um, bits of iron that we've scored, so that we make swords oh. that are roughly the same size. Oh, okay. Mm. You can probably make something a little smaller. We never... <clears throat> Wait. No. Yes. Would that? No. Would it work if I just had two of those on a? Does that make sense? There's what do you have, want? have two arms on a little thing. Pick like up the uh, pincers over there work. as well, and I'll show you how we melt down metal. <clears throat> two arms on. What are you trying to achieve, though? Something gonna be able to change how to be able to. I'm racking my brain on this. It would what? Okay, what's what's the end goal? To find and I'll try and help you get to it. How about that? Good morning. Mr. Something Mason. that is able to make variable measurements and carry over those measurements. You could, for example, I want to measure this. Keep it in <laughs> mind perfectly and move it over here. You could get a piece of metal, lay one on top of the other, and have a sort of like a clamp attached to the bottom one, and then slide it in and out of that clamp. Okay. Alright. Mr. Shang. Yes. Um, he hands you 
very top of paper. Can you do the one again? Oh, yeah, no problem. I have a lot to do today. You, you okay, Miss Biz? No, I can count. I know how to get in. There's... Hmm? You just seem a little quiet, that's all. Me too much. Oh. <clears throat> Good morning, Miss Basil. All right, <clears throat> now we. Uh, oh, this is going to be hard for you. I'm going to show you how we do this. Pass me the pincers. All right. It's actually called calipers. I don't know why they call them pincers, but. There we go. Am I a little louder? Now? Much better. Yeah. And you put it in there. Thank you. And then you wait for it to melt. <clears throat> I know. All right, what do we do with this? Well, I'm going to shape this. We're going to be making falchions today. Mm -hmm. This is what we use the anvil for. Okay. And copper back. My arm's slowly healing, but it's still going to take a bit. So it's fine, you can, you're mainly going to be watching. You're able to just walk in. There's no lock for you. Have it unlocked, you know? Okay. So I think I finally decided on what I might get. I was going to talk to Tazim about it, but uh, I got some silver can... from Miss Raylan. Hmm. Oh, the, the pearl, nice and the uh, fact that she used my spear for... I just wanted to do that to you now, because I'm going Miss to miss Miss Raylan already. For most of the day. Oh, but, uh... You and me both. Enough. Thank you, Mr. Tang. She told me of a thing to make. It's good for using a spear, but also for fishing as well. Multi-purpose. It's a, a, a trident. Spear. Is that what she called it? Yeah, it's a trident. Uh, oh, trident. I know the one you're talking about. Tank. Um, Kyler. So if you want just a tool, Hello? not for it to be used as a um, you would be aware that. Yeah, just tiny. Um, Arden did not go to his room last night and was not in the house. <clears throat> Once again, the forge was not total. run at all. Mm. Have you did seen Tazim today? To no, you were inside as well, weren't you? Right. Oh, yeah, um, I was sleeping underneath your table. Today. He showed up last night and I heard a bunch of banging from his rooms and then... Yeah, sure. When he left, he didn't come back. Yeah, let's do it. A little worried. Reasons why I'm trying to get the mallet. I didn't know people came by to visit. I can go looking for my today if you want. What we can do now? Apparently, when I was trying to work on the stairs, someone went up. I'm gonna quickly check where he might be. I'll be back in like five minutes, okay? Just uh, let that melt down and don't burn the forge down, okay? Yeah, I think it was two um, light All right. I'll be right back. One Elf and one drow. Just, okay. just kind of wing it there. Um, so I have to rebuild that. Um, and the drow there. Meditate, think. Oh, you different from the other hobbits. I should go on morning walks more often.
Guess not. Again, take good care of yourself. I absolutely can't. Shriek. <laughs> Is my axe done? The orcs attacked the logging <clears throat> camp. I'm going after them. Yeah, it should be uh, hanging up. Go grab it and you can pay me later. I'm in the middle of something, too. Alright. I didn't boast about my own complexion most of the time. They might want to make sure that the clinic is stocked. The orcs attack the logging camp. There's going to be a lot of injured. I'm gathering people I can to go and get the people that they took okay. back. So that's, what, so that's what happened with Cassidy. All right, we'll make sure to be ready for that. Don't let them know. All right, thank you. No idea who's Ludwig. going on with me. So far, I have Kang. All right, sure just be ready, ready for it. Just be ready for it. Yes. Get a good night's sleep. Sorry for the delay. Thank you. I'm gonna need a lot of right. stock. What do you think? Your ink gets about the foot melt. Fault. Though, in my experience, right, a helmet is far more useful than a hood and a mask, but it's harder to get a helmet around these parts. There he is. Not sure where it is. You'll have to show me. Forge now. Shriek, it's, it's white and glowing. It's Aye. it's Aye. seeking liquidy. <sighs> yeah, um, just take it out and put it closer to the front. Cassidy was already attacked by one this morning on her way back into town. He was able to kill it, but got to her still. Do you need the prop? Not to mention now it's bleak. Yeah. Right. I'll get it done. My search isn't working, so... Um, just You're pay good. me when you get back. Hopefully you get back. If not, I'll, uh... Find a way to get the money off your corpse, I guess. <laughs> well, you can inherit the debt that I have. 
I would like Should not I? to. Like Zim. Get one of the spare weapons. We have to give Sif a hand with someone. Understood. Then she stole money from me. Severick, can you find me a two-handed sword? My eyes aren't working. How much does she owe you? <clears throat> sure, I got it. Eighty copper. For a necklace. The, the necklace is preferred. I don't know if the skill set's necessary. Any... like this? That's the one. <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't tell you. She was the um, only jeweler I knew of. You going out, Mr. Shriek? What do I do with this? <sighs> Gotta help Sif with something. Keep it out There's of the fire. We'll remelt it later. Okay. By the name of Cassidy. Just keep the fire going. She's a nice woman. She knows the brewmaster. She can sometimes find goods like that. Decent price. I'll try her then. Sorry. You're sure she won't come back? Something custom would be better. I'm positive. Sorry. I did see a... When Miss Raylan was here, so there was a... This fellow think, who yes. did, um... <laughs> instruments like that that uh, worked with us. Fold it. <clears throat> fold the canvas into my arms. Fair enough. How about a button or two? I assume we're... Only thing... We go and watch Sif that one. Understood. At four, counting Shriek, myself. If you're coming to Zim, that's five. I might be able to find him. That'd be six. Oh. I have to move quickly. So much prepared. I don't think we have time to find her then. Don't know where she could be. I am going to say. If we're going farther than the woodcutting camp, the idea of not bringing Soma with us is a scary one. I'll see if he'll come then. Has something happened? Some innocent folks got grabbed up by orcs. Sif wants to help them, so oh. we're helping Sif. All right. Well, take care, you two. We've killed orcs. We right. have a night with us. <clears throat> It'll be fun. Okay. Um, when you get back, do you wanna have that lunch slash breakfast slash dinner? If I can. Not dying, sure. Yeah. Don't die. Please. I'll tell you what, Severick. If you can convince one of the townsfolk to buy a dagger. Or something equivalent. I'll give you half the payment. Oh, so sorry, my brain melted. What was that? What do you, what do you give me in return? If you can get one of the townsfolk to come yeah. by, a check dagger, in with your wife, see if she found all the, the equipment, to have it. which is around five, six silver. I will give you half of the payment. All right, I'll see what I can do. Um. Stay safe, though. We always do. All right. Keep the forge hot. <sighs> Got it. Yeah. 
Good morning. Grab my tankard. Morning. <clears throat> Do you have your we'll armor? Get up. I do have my armor. Why? <sighs> Wanna kill some orcs? Grab your hammer, Sabruka. Oh gosh, I have work today. And you said there's orcs? We're gonna go kill them. If you can't, it's fine. I know the party is a say small, so we don't get sniffed out. But if you think you can, you're welcome to it. It's your call. Someone's coming with. I think Morden's getting water. ready. It's welcome. Give me one second. Even if someone's not going to be able to get any more healing supplies than just what there is, I'd just like it to be known that I do have a potion that's able to be used if any of you get it too injured. I have bandages, <laughs> but I don't know how to use them myself. Well, Soma's here, so... <clears throat> Hopefully we won't need him. Hopefully. We're probably not going to want any more people than we have. Seven and two. I have leather armor. It's just not. It looks like this. Okay. I know more than apron than wanted to come. <laughs> Again, if we bring too many. And we're going as far as you said we are. We're going to attract more attention. Just keep the party small, I think. It's your call. Especially with me trudging behind everybody, I don't think it would be a good idea to have anything large. Hmm. Tazim is right. Too many of us who will spook the orcs early. Too few of us will want to get slaughtered where we stood. A nice even balance is what we need. And do you two have armor? I do. I don't, but I have experience okay, fighting them without it. Same goes for me. Yeah, you, them. Them. you were the one who did the, oh. uh, the craftsmanship with Miss Raylan, right? Uh, I helped Miss Raylan. Uh, we'll give Morden in one more minute. If he's not back by then, we have to go. So I, I can't wait. I'm out of a job or not. So? Well, there's a, there's a lady looking to have a necklace be made. If, if Morden could have sworn that Morden had hung up his axe. That's where we're going to be heading to. Uh, for orcs, he'd take it down. Isn't it that over that way? Oh, that's where I was being in the drag. So we have Morton and someone in tow, it's also nine people going in. Doesn't really sound small, does it? And that news is just as well. I'm on the fence right now for these two. Without armor, even if you're experienced, I'm on the fence. One, but... With orcs being dangerous, it could be a death sentence. If you think about it, you can get yourself a dagger, protect yourself. Can't I don't want to have any more lives on my conscience. Last night, but this looks like timeless. Or something like that. Sentence if you, we play it small. Well, uh, see if you can talk sure. it out with the the smith and uh, with that. I can't uh, remember <laughs> anything the way the mirror was making out. Uh, <laughs> Yeah. Alright, let's get moving. We'll have to go with that mortal. At the start of the hour. Somebody needs to look after the forge anyway. My Soma. I'm guessing he's still getting his stuff. If you want, I can go and grab him. Sure, please. You know <clears> the <throat> way. Alright. Yes, I do. Alright. Let's move then. From All what right, I know. Soma, that makes sense. Southern. From what I know, the Southern Orcs. 
look to be about 20 of them, so they're probably green. They're Not a scout green. party, it's a raiding party. Alright, green orcs. 20 of them. <coughs> they have hostages. I'm mad at them. <coughs> Alright, I do know where they went. Thankfully, scouted that area many times. Though once they drop down into the crags, I don't know where they went. We can kill orcs, sure, but how are we going to make sure these hostages get out? My lord, I believe that makes nine total. Nine? From what I've heard, that makes nine total. Three... Clifford went to get some. Six, seven, eight. That make it. Eight, nine with Morden. Right. That's pushing it. Any weapons? With this, or with this many, I guess we better go loud. No, I use my best. I was able to kill the other one. Want to keep this party Pretty smaller? Much. The hell is that? Pretty much, Mitt turned his head on the opposite side. I warned against it. Let me turn that it looks like Mr. Point. Soma, a surgeon. I did advise him coming along. And a hunter yes. is trailing. I won't have... I, I will not have Raven with us. Misplace my gods, but I am ready. This is entirely right. too many people. This is way too many. There are too many people. This is entirely. Uh, do you two mind staying behind? I want to make sure this party's small and without armor I can't risk your lives. It's still too many. Gamus, you're not. The worry isn't how well equipped people are, it's how many people are here. Yeah. We shouldn't have more. The more people, five, the honest. more sent. Mm. Six is pushing it. I will have to ask you two to stay. Without armor, I don't want to risk either of your lives, and I don't know you well enough, unfortunately. And if I heard him correctly, you're resting off some kind of an injury. Because of the other orc that was dragging me. Then stay. Take we'll care make, of each other. We'll try to we'll make it back. back quickly. Can he pass if we find the, the camp, we can mount the... Kids off. If we find the camp, we'll need everyone we can to assault it. So... Rest up until then. Yeah. Get armor. Let's Although keep we were moving. trying to rescue the people there, not assault a camp. No, but if we find their main camp, then perhaps we can do something about it. <clears throat> I'm here to rescue people. Not we do not camp. have anywhere near the That's numbers to deal with the main camp. Exactly. We're not attacking the main camp if we can help it. Very well. All right, where to? Start to get overwhelmed. We can bail. This way. Follow me. I can try and see if I can help guide the people out and get them to safety, or hit by any means. Too much time has been spent on. How many healing supplies did you bring along? The people come first. Everything else is hundred percent. Agreed. So, broker, anything Aye. you see that's wearing armor. That's your target. Kill it. I'm alone. Sharik? Hmm. Anything that seems faster than the rest of us? Those agile bastards that usually use two weapons? Mm. Get them before they flank around us, won't you? Understood. If I see a single brawler orc, I'm going to kill myself. <laughs> I'll throw myself at them, surely. Hopefully they don't God. have another troll. 
It didn't look like it from the footprints, but I can never count on that. By the gods, one can only hope. The ones from yesterday and the hunting expedition seemed pretty feral. I'm not sure about these that Sif's talking about. We'll find out. I just fucking had a dream. What? Well, something I'm thinking to myself. Mm. Mm. <laughs> I did have a dream, probably while they were attacking last night, of the orcs' darkness encroaching. They were trained, or at least acted organized. I don't know if that's a warning that these ones are, or if it was just a reminiscing of the mountains. <clears throat> Wait, organized? It's completely possible. You have the same fear as I have, young lad. I'd like to see this from my own eyes. If these are organized, we're in for one hell of a time. No, if these are organized. To the gods, I don't see him. God, everything seems normal here. I don't see anything out of the ordinary. No, it'll be when we come up to the crossroads up ahead. Okay. I'll be looking on the left. I doubt they'd be out in the daytime, but stay prepared. Remember, uh, hmm? yeah. most of us have dealt with orcs before. They can take several hits before they go down. Do not stab them first thing. They will eat that, and then they'll be free to swing on you and try to hold your blade. Don't allow it to happen. Mm. Right. That's why I like an axe. I prefer one a little bit bigger. What do we do when they go into a death rage, honestly? Don't try to take one on alone. Call for help, whoever's closest to you. Tag team them. Ah. <sighs> Aim for ligaments. <clears throat> Make their limbs useless. I can usually tell by the ear piercing scream just before. <laughs> or in your case, the crack. <laughs> yeah. Alright, they'll the be going up to the left. Day. Oh, Alright, there's the logging camp. Yep, and they came up this way. So they did. As you move forward, Sif, you see a little bit to your right, a log by the side of the road. On it looks like several markings of a weapon smashed into it, blood spattered, almost as if somebody was carving meat. Can we even let it take it back to camp, huh, beasts? So. One's most likely not alive anymore. Do you want me to look ahead, Sif? See if I can get a glimpse of him. Hmm? Do you want me to scout ahead? See if we can find them before they find us. 
If anything, they're in the crags already. But sure, if you want to stay ahead. Just be very careful. Whatever went that way is a smaller group. So found some tracks that way that cut over the stone. There's a lot of them running in columns. Organized. We've seen this before. Let's War be very was, careful. You think? I don't know. Maybe. All right. If that is the case, Nordis is in trouble. It doesn't have war. <laughs> that was one of the traps I was talking about. All right, all right. I can't use my on the hill. Doesn't look like they're going too fast, but they're pooling every now and then. Don't talk, just wait. We have a medic. Just hang on for a little bit more. Got a healer on the way. Oh my god. Soma! Shh. I got it. You gonna take a look at the wounds with a DC severity? Soma, as you look at this man, you see he's already incredibly pale. You see multiple wounds and bite marks. That's actually quite beautiful.
<clears throat> Dude, this feels like um Twin uh, uh the two towers, Lord of the Rings. Where they're like tracking Merry and Pippin. He watches a man finally <coughs> cough and cough and blood spews from his mouth, dripping. Kyla? I do not want to assume yes. what that might be. You don't see anything out in the distance. The terrain is multi leveled and difficult to discern. There are a few bits of movement here and there, close by, the most notable by the head of you. Doesn't look like they're hiding in particular. But you only see the one. And when there is one, there's hardly ever just one. The blood trails and drag marks continue into the rocky terrain. I've found a lone orc down there. Want me to take care of it? Kill it. from behind. Uh, the orc goes down. But you know that this is likely just a forward scout. I'm getting slow. Likely to be many more awaiting you. He's gonna pat it down for anything interesting, anything out of the ordinary. Doesn't expect much, but. You guys need to invest in soap. If the blood trail goes past here. I mean, this is fine. I didn't search the corpse or anything. <laughs> oh. 
stamping her feet on the other side and begin to see a spear cresting the rock ahead of you. Multiple orcs coming our way. They got long arms. Spread out, facing that way. Spread out along the rocks. Wait till they get close. Shit. See it. Oh, God. Maybe we don't slip them out. We'll bring you back. I killed a boy. You find anything? Uh, oh, I can't hear me. <laughs> you see anything? Oh, yeah. But within 11, the orcs, they know something's here, <clears throat> just don't know two. quite where. You feel sufficiently hidden, but perhaps your party is not.
I think they're starting to move away. I know something's here. Kyler. <clears throat> Looking over the area, you saw vaguely where they went, or that tree to the right, but you have no way of knowing where that leads. They went roughly that way, but with all the rocks, they could be changing any direction at any point. Mm. We'll cut that way just to be safe. They did come from... It's um, undoubtedly... They came down this way. Hundreds down here. Where'd it go now? Sure, Dill always talked about fighting them for so long in the town. They're falling in this valley. They have to be careful. They are crawling right. in this valley. If it looks too bad... We tried to get everyone to fall back. Understood. I don't want any last stands here. They came up this ridge line here, so if... After that, I don't know where they would have come from. They came up from here? This is the first place I saw them, yeah. If they came right. this way from here, that must be the patrol route, right? We'll go the opposite they go. Yeah. That's what they I was thinking. From something. The fact that they're giving patrols is something more than that. <laughs> Could be. If. As you continue to track the heavy footprints and the blood continue this way. They went this way. Yeah, they went this way. As you reach the corner, you turn to your right and see some semblance of maybe a camp or fortification. Well, as in Bullet Scout.
the blood trail comes this way a lot of heavy footfalls so they're either at this camp or currently with an 11 plus 2 you feel stealthy enough and you're not seen and as you peek through the rocks and the tree ahead of you you notice and hear but do not see the source of it you hear weeping human weeping You hear a whistle from behind. Sif, <laughs> as you begin to inch forward closer and closer, you can hear it now too the wailing of a woman. Blood curdling scream. Throw it far to give uh, Shariq the opening to his back. As you throw the rock with a seven, With an eight plus two, you nearly lose your footing on the rock. And stay stock still. As it, the creature before you slowly begins to go past. This is the camp. Are you sure? We're probably going to have to fight them. Yes, there was a woman screaming. <laughs> that she can get it off to. Well, 